Hey guys, I'm going to try to walk you through Bitmoji. So if you are just on your home page and you just search um, Bitmoji uh, extension, and it's a Chrome extension, and then um, you can just click on the link. And yours would say add to Chrome. Mine says remove because I already have it added. And then once you add it, see, since I've already added it, I'm not sure it will do this. But for you, once you've added it, it will ask you to sign in to either Snapchat or Bitmoji, whichever one you use. I mean, most people use Bitmoji through Snapchat, but not always. So anyway, I am going to skip that part because I'm already logged in. And um, I'm going to try to remember how to. Uh, oh, so then, OK, so once you've got it on there, you should see this little puzzle piece up here. And this is the list of extensions. And you're going to want to go down to Bitmoji and yours will look like this. It won't be pinned. So you need to pin it. And as soon as you do, you'll see that little green icon, that Bitmoji icon show up. So. So then, um, for example, for our wall, I wanted to, I put a, a welcome. And so what you're going to do is you can put that or you can just search for whatever, or you can just look at all of the different ones that you can choose to pick from. Um, anyway, so once you do that, let's say I'm going to go to my recent one. So I'm going to click on that. So now, um, actually, you'll want to like right click and you can save your image as. So go ahead and click on save your image. And then I should, I just, I always change this to something that makes sense. Like, um, welcome it emoji. I'm going to put the number there just because, and I always put mine on my desktop and I'm going to hit save. And then I'm going to go to my, my desktop and it's actually already there. Well, that's not the one I'm using, but anyway. So then I have this one and what you'll do is you'll just email me and you will attach this and then you are done. Uh, don't forget to um, also answer those questions. I think the size of 24 would be large enough to be able to see. I may change my mind on that after I played around with it for a little bit. But um, if you go back to the email, you'll see four questions that you can answer. And then I'll just cut those out and um, put them underneath your, your Bitmoji. Hopefully this helps. Thanks. Bye.